my love. When we first set sail and pushed off to sea, I stood at the bow looking backward, dry-eyed and imagining that the world in all its color and grandeur and majesty had been devastated by that same flood I'd seen when I told you that my father was making me leave. It was a midsummer night's eve, and in my heart, it was a romance, the same Shakespearean tragedy, that quintessential teenage flickering that let love burn brighter in the reminiscent memories as we slowly fell asleep, cuddling beneath the stars that I wished upon through the cutout at the top of the teepee. It doubled by day as an Indian fort, with girls have cooties stitched across the seams, and at night, our secret love affair that the cowboys would have deemed a crime punishable by cat gun and sour faces and wild, wild west make believe. Old enough to comprehend, but young enough to dream. I can still hear the rhythm of your breathing 